Good morning. Today I'm going to catch the tram and go meet someone at the northern part of the city. Mohammed 5 is the station I need to go to right now. to Elfell now. This is the station I need to stop at. There's this member from Warm Showers and she works here at Clinique de Jajman. It's a place over here and I see on the top it says written Polyclinique Le Jasmine. It must be some sort of clinic that she works at. I gotta meet her first and then I'm gonna continue onwards to Barcelona station. We're going to meet Iman and we're going to go to this town called Nubuel on the coastline. It's about an hour away and from there I'm going to spend all day and then possibly stay there tonight or else continue on to Sifax. It's my plan. All right, I made it here. So I'm Jason. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How many years have you been a member of One Showers? I think two years and ten months. Oh, you're so precise. <laughs> yeah, because uh, last uh, last night I checked and I saw uh, my membership. Uh, ah, okay. Yeah. So uh, how did you discover Warm Showers? Because I'm already uh, a traveler with a bike and the bike ah. fan. So. <laughs> I see. That's pretty good. Yeah, I've, uh, I've, the longest distance I did with a bicycle was 206 miles or about 300 kilometers maybe. Oh. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, it was pretty good. Two days from Seattle to Portland. Bad. Yeah. So you, uh, what kind of bike do you have? Like a road bike or a city bike? City bike. Okay. And you ride around Tunisia. Uh, I went to Europe with it last year. Oh really? Wow. Yeah. That's pretty good. So where will we go right now? To like a cafe? Yeah. Okay. Which one? Yep. That one. Ah. Okay. Great. I really like how you, when the world is upside down and people are afraid and scared and everything, you just took. Ticket to book this ticket and yeah, I'm going to Kirkland, Tunisia. So it's really, it's really nice. It's yeah, really brave. Yeah, for I tried. me it's brave. I don't know. Uh, for people it's something else. So what happened? You were also supposed to travel during this period? Yeah, and since um, I also depend uh, on the way of travel because uh, I do hitchhike oh, and really? I do okay. yeah sleep at people's places. Mm. Uh, I was thinking that people would be scared also. So. I wouldn't yeah. enjoy my trip. So. Yeah, there's there's some people that are afraid of uh, hosting these days and also uh, picking you up as a hitchhiker. Exactly. So like usually the chances are low. already low, yeah. but now they're lower. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, so it's it's kind of a challenge, but still I still manage. Yeah. Yeah. Lucky you. <laughs> and uh, it's it's good that there is still humanity in this world, like, even though this whole like shit pandemic. So, yeah. <laughs> There is so, still humanity and people are still hosting. Yeah, but you know, um, I noticed that there's the group of people who really believe in the pandemic and then the group who doesn't believe in it, the pandemic. In Tunisia? Yeah, even in Tunisia. So it's the group that is not so worried about it that hosts or picks you up at hitchhiking. Well, it's a little <laughs> bit uh, confusing because uh, I don't want to like call it two groups because, ah. for example, there are my friends. Yeah. When I am around them, they do trust me. Mm, okay. It's like about trust issues. Yeah, okay. So, but when there is an outsider, they don't trust them. So that's when they realize there is a coronavirus, mm. blah, blah, you know. Oh, it's see. not about believers and non believers. Yeah, because when I message people here in Tunisia, they ask me which country are you coming from. And then they were thinking about the green list, the orange list, and the red list. I don't think so. Oh, really? No. Uh, it's like uh, you've been in the airport, so the airport is a risky zone. Yeah, so everyone's there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but no. so far, so good. Yeah. I'm still healthy. <laughs> good for you. <laughs> we'll see. But Karakana Island is supposed to be pretty nice. Have you been there? No, but no. my friends were there and uh -huh. um, they said... Um, I, I don't know if you've been to Jerba before. 
Yeah, I flew to Durba. I stayed like a couple days. Yeah, they they told me that Durba is more interesting. Well, yeah, it's bigger. And more interesting. And more interesting, yeah. It's supposed to be really peaceful at Kirkana. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, people so. are there, there are working as um, uh, fishing. Fishing? Yeah. They oil do. refinery? Hmm? What about oil refinery? No? Oh. So mainly fishing. Yeah. Okay. The activity there. For my host in Suffolk suggested that he join me and we go by bicycle around the island. Nice. So it's an idea I was thinking. I just don't know how big the island is, but no, it's not. It's not so big. No. Okay. And also there are small um, islands next to Kirkna. There is yeah. Sifno. Mm, okay. So maybe you can ask him to mm. take you there. There are small islands also. Mm, okay. If he has a boat or something. Oh yeah, we'll check. Maybe we'll hire a boat yeah. over there. Yeah. Merci. What's the coffee called? American. And yours? Direct. Ah, yours is direct, okay. Mm -hmm. What's the difference? I think this is the called in America, called in America latte. Ah, okay. And this is the, this is the American? Americano. Yeah, American. Well, that was nice to meet with her, Afnan. I oh, had a nice coffee there. Now I'm gonna head to Barcelona station down this way. It should take about 25, 30 minutes. And that's the place where you can catch the buses out of town. They're called Luage. I'm at El Fail now. I'm gonna take the tram to La Republique and then change over to Barcelona. here at Barcelona at the main station here and there's so much trash here it'd be probably an idea to clean it all up but then where would you store the garbage I'm not sure this is a clock tower but it's broken it's kind of a pedestrian area in the middle of this big intersection <laughs> to Babeliwa, which is the station where I can pick up the transport to get to Nabuo. It's about five more minutes, I think. I arrived to Babeliwa, where I'm supposed to meet Iman. And from here, we're gonna take that bus. Apparently, this is the bus station. How are you? Hi. Nice to see you. <laughs> you finally made Let's it. Go. Okay. So <laughs> Can I make sure? Yes. Hey, hey man, how are you? Fine, Good. thank you. Fine, thanks. So where do we go now? Oh, never. Okay, good. You can you can get the ticket and yes. speak. Yeah. yeah. Okay, good. Over here. Nabua. Alright, we made it on the bus. Hey, do you think we can take the bus to Bob? Yes. No one will see us. <laughs> hey, can I be on that side? Oh. 
Okay, we should find the seaside now. Yes. Yeah. Do you know how to get there? Yeah. Okay. So is this the main entrance? Yeah. Okay. It looks really nice. I think this is the Medina. Yeah. Okay. There's a restaurant. Let's see. Restaurant de la Jeanne. Jeunesse. I got uh, lentil soup here and it's a spicy type. Alright, so that was a pretty good meal. <laughs> this is some sort of square with uh, the flag over there. It's kind of just outside the Medina. It seems pretty historical. I'm curious what these guys represent. Let's see if there's a plaque. All right, we made it just to the seaside right now, the Mediterranean Sea. It seems to be pretty calm, not so much wind. I see some fishermen out there. Let's see, we got just like this. Have you been to this beach before? Yes. Yeah? Yes. That's good. So, let's see. Skala. Hala? Skala. Oh, yeah. What's that mean? Skala. <laughs> Viscala? Yes. Maybe it means pier. <laughs> That's what it means, Pierre, I think. Hey, watch out, there's a puddle here. Do you like the photos? Yes. Iman, hmm? what is this one over here? Theater. Oh, okay. It's a theater and plain air. And a fast food restaurant, but it's kind of closed right now. So I wonder where the plain air one is. Maybe behind the building, I don't know. Maybe it has an interior court. Ah, we need a taxi. Iman's gonna go back to the bus station. Wow, look at all these peppers. So a man caught the 3.30 bus. She'll be back in Tunis at around 4.30. It's about an hour's ride. And I'm gonna go meet up with my host now. He's He was visiting the forest and he's gonna come back around four o'clock. So I'm just gonna hang out at a cafe. It was pretty nice meeting Iman. She was a nice girl. And we might meet on Monday when I leave. And this place is called the Pest Resto Cafe. So I made it here. For dinner we got chicken pasta, is that right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, and the... Pasta with chicken, yeah. Yeah, there we go. That's good. And then what's the specialty thing that we have in Tunisia? Harissa. <laughs> Did your mom make this one? 
Yeah, of course. Mm, okay. What's inside, you think? Chili. Then they put garlic and uh, some spices. Mm, no mint. Even mint. And, uh... and especially for Tunisia. Yeah, it's really Tunisian. Yeah? Like, yeah. <laughs> it's very Tunisian. Oh, okay. Thing. I'll try some then. Let's see. So, yeah. Algerians and Moroccans don't eat uh, spicy food. Oh, they don't like spicy food? Yeah, like, there, there is a, you can find it only in Tunisia. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. There is some banana Yeah. There is some banana Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, we like spicy food, yeah. Mm, okay. So this morning I met with Afnan, and Afnan um, recommended I contact you, Yosef. Yeah. So I was happy to meet you here, and luckily I was uh, coming to visit this town. What's your name? Ayub. Ayub. And how long have you been living in Nabul? For 35 years. Really? Your whole life? <laughs> yeah. How, how many people live in Nabul? In the big city, maybe... Uh, Oh, yes. The name of uh, some uh, prophet uh, Job. Mm. You, you know Job? Prophet Job. Yes. Yeah. Say Ayub. Like the we say Ayub. Oh, so Job means Ayub. Yeah. Oh, I say I understand. <laughs> In your language, Job. Yeah. In our language, Ayub. Ah, oh, okay, that's a good one. I didn't know that before. Mm. So you had chicken pasta, and I'm gonna have some. Would you call this Tunisian salad? So basically, tomatoes, cucumbers, ah, and ah, onions. Ah, yeah. Tunisian uh, salad, Tunisian. Like it's Tunisian salad. Tunisian yeah. salad. Yeah. Yeah. You can See. find this anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Tunisia? Yeah. Yeah, most of the time, yeah. Mm, okay. Like, but normally, like you will find with some egg and some yeah. eggs. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just you need to mix <laughs> it. Uh, there's uh, onions there. Then. Yeah, I see onion. You, you see, you First. know onion. Yeah, onion. Salah, <laughs> onion. Onion, onion, 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 onion.